this week as part of the efforts to resuscitate the struggling economy, the Fed announced plans to step in and buy commercial paper. So a lot of us are asking, what exactly is commercial paper? Well, the commercial paper marketplace is actually worth $1.6 trillion. It's a huge part of the economy. And basically, its purpose is for companies to uh, meet their short-term financing obligations. This could be for payroll, supplies, anything like that. So for instance, um, if an airline is managing its receivables and it doesn't have the cash coming in to meet its short-term needs, it still obviously has obligations to continue financing or continue operating, I should say. Um, so if it needs to meet fuel costs, it might issue commercial paper, which typically has a, a maturity of anywhere from overnight to a week or two. And in recent weeks, that market has become frozen. Companies haven't been able to tap into that cash, which is a cheaper way of financing those needs rather than going to a bank for a, a line of credit where they would pay a higher interest rate. Um, so the Fed's efforts are to help unfreeze that and to get uh, more liquidity in the market so that companies can meet their ongoing needs, which fundamentally include payroll, you know, the most basic uh, need that we need our employers to make. So that's why it's so critical that the Fed stepped in.